All right, all right, all right. We get to update these numbers today. All of them. We had a good meet on Sunday. Ended up doing a lot better than I thought I would. Just want to make sure everybody knows it. All right, so my weight class actually went down from 109 to 102. Dude, I hate my handwriting. My snatch went up to 121 from 118. Man, that one was a fight. And then clean and jerk surprised me, 150. It's been a goal for, the, for a very long time. And we just YOLO'd it. And somehow <laughs> we stuck the landing. New total is 271. A six kilo jump. Going down a weight class. We'll take it. This thing's so heavy. <laughs> All right, well, we just competed on Sunday. Took off Monday and Tuesday. Wednesday, back at it again. So, since I competed on Sunday, I'm just gonna count that as my kind of like day one of the week. Since that strongman comp is only like three weeks away, I'm gonna keep pushing it this week. This guy, he doesn't have any strength training videos anymore because he's a runner now. So he has to come video bomb my strength training videos. Either that or he has a question on how to use the computer. I didn't say anything. I'll be right back. <laughs> I'll be back at three. Alright bro. Are you gonna edit? Yeah. Alright, don't just name myself. Well, you should have saved it. Alright. <laughs> Later, bro. Get out of here, dude. <laughs> you act like you lift strong. You know, you know Coach Matt's the real strong man. Yeah, okay, okay. Hey, we'll find out. We'll find out. In three weeks. Yeah, really, I'm just going to treat this like a max effort week. I'm going to max out on all the lifts. I'll deload next week. And then ramp back up the following week to, to compete that weekend. I'm already beat up from that weightlifting comp, but let's just keep on riding it. So I'm gonna do a heavy log today. I'll probably just build up the comp weight, to be honest. Let my body feel it. Um, I'll probably build up to comp weight on the yoke later this week. And then just keep my body moving next week, more of a deload. But here we go. Log, clean and jerks. At least I've been clean and jerking, you know? <clears throat> you know what? Never really done it before, but let's see what the Viper press is looking like today. Oh yeah. I just gotta do that with another like 100 pounds. I don't think I'd move that smooth if it was heavier. Yeah, that one felt good. There goes the competition. No talk to me right now, we're not friends. All right, 175. Let's see how far we could go with just the Viper. Kind of tricky because that log's kind of rolling back this way and i got to transfer that energy from the momentum going back to just straight up at the same time so really it's just figuring out that timing for me oh that was a good one that felt good all right 200 here we come
Dog, how's my shin bleeding? There's like zero knurling on this. <laughs> yeah. The Viper Press takes the least amount of time to complete the rep from the ground all the way overhead. So if I can get two, maybe three Viper Presses right off the bat, that'll save me so much time. And then once it starts feeling heavy, because I'm tired, I'll likely switch into either a power jerk or a split jerk. But it's all about being efficient. When you're doing these reps, as many reps possible in a minute, efficiency is the key. Come on. Like straight strong man mode got my knee sleeves two belts wrist wraps <laughs> all right this is comp weight right here 225 i'm only gonna hit it for three regardless but based off how that last the last set moved I doubt I'm going to get three, three reps with the Viper Press, so even if I can get just one, get one rep in the first like five seconds, you know, got to try to clip this. Hopefully I don't throw up. Yeah, I think it's pretty tight. So it's definitely not set for two belts, but... Whatever, hopefully we don't pass out. <laughs> it's slipping on my belt, bro. I'm not used to all this equipment. I just felt like too compressed. All right, I'm not even gonna clip it. I'm gonna leave it like this. All right, so definitely no Viper Press. It's all about getting that timing down. And I did that all in one breath. That's why we practice. Reset before the push. sucked. I don't want to fully recover. My heart rate's still up a little bit. I'm telling you, there's a lot of conditioning that goes into strongman. It's probably what I haven't been doing. Um, however, you know, I just clean and jerked a hundred more pounds than what's on, on the log right now on Sunday. So the only thing that's really helping me out is that my, my overhead is significantly stronger than what the comp weight is. And that's not like, uh, <laughs> not a brag at all. I'm just saying like my conditioning sucks. So if your conditioning is going to suck, you better make up for it with strength. I 
one more right away. Let's go right away. Extra credit. Yeah. Mm -hmm.